Violence erupts in the streets of Buenos Aires moments after Argentina's Senate rejected a bill that would have legalized abortion. Riot police used tear gas to disperse the crowds. At least seven people were arrested. Ahora sí, se vota. The Senate voted 38 to 31 against the proposed bill, which would have given women the right to have an abortion into the 14th week of pregnancy. But the controversial decision drew wild celebration in another part of the city, showing the deep divide that remains in the birthplace of Pope Francis. I am overwhelmed with joy. I feel joy for my God, she says. Currently, abortions are only allowed in the cases of rape or if the mother's health is at risk. But Argentina's Ministry of Health estimates 350,000 are performed illegally every year. Uruguay and Cuba remain the only Latin American countries to have broadly legalized abortion. Meanwhile, the death toll has now passed 300 after a powerful earthquake struck the Indonesian island of Lombok right here beside Bali. And that number is expected to increase as powerful aftershocks continue to hit the region. A child's scream pierces the air as families scramble for safety. That aftershock, measuring 6.2, that's just shy of the original 6.9 magnitude quake that rattled the island on Sunday. There's been so many earthquakes, she says. There are cracks in my room. That's why we're afraid. So as a precaution, we need to run out during the quakes. The same aftershock also triggered panic at a government press conference. The Red Cross says some villages have completely collapsed, giving way to a potential humanitarian crisis. An estimated 270,000 people have been left homeless. Many of them are in desperate need of clean water, food and medicine.